One thing an operator may find themselves needing to do on a daily basis is change the pressure of the system. AIM Command Flex makes it even easier than before. To begin setting up preset pressure valves, touch the Settings button on the right side of the screen. This is the button with the set of gears shown. Go to the System Settings menu on the second tab and then into the Preset Settings menu. In this menu, you can choose two pressure presets and the pressure delta or pressure bump. This can be any number, but remember, the pressure will change by this value when either manually increasing or decreasing the pressure. Also ensure that the gauge's toggle quick key selection box is checked. This setting allows you to easily change between presets and increase decrease pressure delta anytime the pressure gauge is touched. Once the preset pressures and pressure delta are entered, touch OK. This takes you back to your system's settings, and from there you can hit the Home button on the right-hand side of the screen. Doing this takes you back to the Home screen. To see the preset pressure you entered, touch the gauge under the title Pressure. Now, the two preset pressures should be displayed with the gauge icon on the right-hand side of the screen. To toggle between each pressure, simply touch on the appropriate button. If you need to change or bump the pressure manually, touch the pressure gauge to change the icons to a plus or minus. Touching these buttons will alter the pressure by the amount you entered previously. If the presets or the pressure bump don't satisfy a specific target pressure, you can always touch in the target pressure box above the pressure gauge and change the pressure manually at any time. Your actual pressure will be displayed below the pressure gauge where you see SIM in this video. SIM is displayed because this video is created using a simulated rate. We hope this video has helped you understand how to use your new Patriot sprayer equipped with AIM Command Flex from Case IH. Don't forget to check out our other videos covering a wide range of setup and operation topics to learn more about making AIM Command Flex work for you.